morning guys and welcome to today's vlog. We are currently on the way to the doctor's office for our second baby appointment. We're actually stopping by at the grocery store really quick because they have a little like station where you can fill up like buy balloons. Oh my god. How are you doing that if you're in four wheel drive? Guys, I can't function with snow. I feel like that's something that you need to learn. Like no. there's always gonna be a little slide to okay, snow. Okay, whatever. Anyways, we're stopping at the grocery store really quick because we're actually doing our little like baby announcement photo shoot today. So our friend Maria is coming over to snap some pictures and I have a little balloon I got on Amazon that says baby and then I thought it'd be cute to just have some like balloons and stuff. I think we're just gonna shoot it in our room. So I'll probably just run in really quick and get those it like takes them like an hour or so to fill them up so we're gonna order them now go to the doctor and then head back to the grocery store pick them up and then get ready for the shoot i can't believe we're like announcing it this week we've just known for so long i'm 11 weeks and we found out at like three so we've known for like seven weeks it has been wait is that the right math how many are you saying no seven no it's wait eight guys pregnancy brain is real and i'm also just known for eight <laughs> bad at math eight weeks but we've known for like two months it has seriously just been so long and i actually feel like it's kind of gone by fast yeah Don't it really you? has it's gone by really fast. like a month you're, ago you're like three months right i'm in my third month yeah i was thinking about that in the shower this morning you're almost three months pregnant no i'm in my third month already. oh you are over three months pregnant wait what? You're just trying to confuse me now. I don't, guys. Oh. Did on. you get everything? Yeah, it's so sunny. My eyes are like watering. I know. I went and took Luma out this morning and I literally did not open my eyes for one second while I was out there. A couple cars drove past and I like stuck my hand up and waved just with my eyes closed. Is that okay? Yeah. That's your baby. Mm -hmm. That's right, you got a baby here too. Wow. Okay guys, so we're done at the doctor. Quickest doctor's appointment ever. At the beginning, they were seriously like two minutes long. Basically, we just listened to the heartbeat and it was like, hey, yeah, you're good. But it's so fun to hear the heartbeat. It was so fun. Yeah, it was. And guys, he said that the heartbeat is in the little girl range. Because apparently, little girl heartbeats are usually a little bit faster. Not every single time, obviously. He said that. So now we're just at the grocery store really quick. I don't even know what we need. We have strawberries, like all organic ones, trying to be healthy. They didn't look as good as the other ones, but it's worth it for our baby, right? I also really want apple juice. Where's that? I still have a lot of food aversions where I don't really want to like eat a lot of stuff. So it's been really hard to eat healthy. Like veggies and rice just sounds so, so, so bad. Now that I'm getting closer to my second trimester and I haven't been feeling actually like as nauseous, I feel like I need to just really start pushing through it and eating healthy. So I'm trying to think of meals and stuff that I usually have. I seriously have not had like a good healthy home cooked meal in so long. I got our balloons. I can't tell if this is gonna be enough. I hope so. It's like a lot right now, but in our house, hopefully it is enough. I also got some stuff the other day. I was telling you guys about my bean dip and I got some stuff to try and make a vegan version. So I want to try that today. I got vegan cream cheese and vegan cheese. It also requires sour cream, but it's like two tablespoons. So I'm just going to skip that because that barely makes a difference. Normally I never get green grapes. I always get purple, but I tried one of these and they're so crispy and so good. have to kind of like tape some of these down lower so they're not all up on the ceiling when we're shooting pictures but i'm about to try and blow up one of these balloons that i got i got these on amazon and the reviews are mixed it says baby i actually got two of them in case it pops wait wasn't even in that was so fast 
I'm actually gonna get on Amazon right now and see if I can order her like a little dog outfit that says big sister because I think that would be cute. Big sister dog. All right guys, our photographer is here. This is Cody and Bria. We met them when we went on a trip to Africa. They're here to take <laughs> pics. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Here's my dog. Hi, I'm Cody um, from Reno, Nevada. Stop. No, 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 don't. <laughs> I'm like, this is my dad joke husband. <laughs> so this, is, this is our little setup for now. So we have the baby balloon. And good news, the doctor literally, actually was the nurse, she just called and was like, oh, we just got your test results back. Luckily, Cody saw my phone ringing. I've like had, like I get random, <coughs> Luma. I always get like random calls of like automated <coughs> like salespeople things. So I usually never answer if it's a number I don't know, but I've been answering, so I'm waiting <coughs> for the doctor to call. <coughs> and if you guys remember a couple weeks ago, our mirror showed up shattered. And so I've been waiting for them to oh, call me about like that. that. So I've been answering every single uh. random number phone call Cody was like oh your phone's ringing but it's a random yeah. number like you probably don't want to answer and I was like no I'll answer and it was the nurse so I remember when we, that happened yeah I'm super excited because it means that we are officially doing the gender reveal this weekend so yeah we're about to shoot our announcement Like it's weird that we've had this secret and then like now literally the world is gonna know. I'm it's, excited. It's like exciting, but then it's also kind of just like a weird thing like, oh wow, like everybody's gonna know. Yeah, we're heading to the doctor's office now and they called us earlier. Like I said, told us that everything on the test that we did looked really good and they have the gender in an envelope. So Parker's going to run in and grab that. You have to make sure that it's like not see-through because yeah. I'm such a cheater, guys. Like. I'll I will inspect <laughs> it. I'll yeah. look at it. But I'll, I don't want I'll you to know what it is. I'll look in it and make sure that I. I am like such a cheater at stuff like this or like board games <laughs> or anything. We have to make sure that we cannot see it. We have to like put it away because I'll I know sure. that I'm not going to look at it because this is something that's like so important and special. And so I don't want to like ruin it for myself if it was like something that yeah, wasn't I as big was of a deal. Yeah, I kind of was hoping that we would get it on Friday. So it was like. I just, I just want to have it and no, make sure. No, but it's like a week of it just sitting there. That's why you have to put it away. Anyways. If it was something not as serious, I would probably look at it, but I really want to like film our genuine reaction. Yeah, yeah. So are you still thinking boy or do you feel like it could be a girl? Yeah, I'm thinking boy. I feel like I'm going to be really surprised if it's a boy just because of the heartbeat, which I know that's not even like a real thing, but I'm just super excited to find out. Are you looking for dad? Are you stressed? You can't find him? Here it is. <laughs> Top secret. Okay. We're getting ready to hit publish on our YouTube video where we announced that we're pregnant and we're about to post it on Instagram too. Yeah, we're both posting on Instagram and then we have the vlog and then my main channel video all going up at the same time. I'm nervous. Are you nervous? Yeah, I'm nervous. I'm so excited. All right, you ready? ready? Did you hit publish on this? No, here. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Changes okay. are being saved. Okay, ready? So all changes are saved. Yeah, one. Two, three. three. Posting. I'm so excited. I'm posted. I do. That was the tenth like on yours. Okay, guys. So it's been a few hours. I'm now making my vegan bean dip. So the only ingredients that I switched out is vegan cheese and vegan cream cheese. And then, like I said at the store, it's you're supposed to use like two tablespoons of sour cream. But since that's such a small amount, I didn't want to like buy vegan sour cream for just for that. I'm going to attempt to mix this all together. And my main concern is with a lot of vegan cheeses, they don't like melt like regular cheese, but. This is the one that I'm using. Follow your heart, vegan cheese. It says on the back that it melts great. And then there were two different cream cheeses I was picking between. This one says it's made from almond milk and the other one had a bunch of like coconut ingredients. So I felt like it was gonna be like super coconutty. So I didn't wanna use that. Hopefully if this like melts and is fine, I'm sure that this cream cheese tastes like pretty normal. And then I don't know if I've had this kind of vegan cheese before, but it can't be that bad, right? So we're just gonna test it out and see. I need to mix this first. Just gotta add the tacos sauce 
I also cut the recipe in half, so this is like way too big of a container. But it was all I had. Also, if you guys ever make this, I recommend that you buy one of those like things at the store that's like something you cook in and then you throw it away because this is so hard to clean. Do you think it's gonna be good, Boo Boo? Good. I don't think it's gonna taste that bad. No, it'll be all right. I think it will be good. I'm excited to see. We should have made them side by side and tested oh. them out side by side. Okay guys, the bean dip is done. Looks pretty normal. I took it out like 10 minutes early because I'm too excited to try it. But yeah, but it's not actually like cooking anything. It's just like eating it. This big old food. The longest one I've ever seen. Okay, subscribe for more good oh, content. <laughs> it's still good. Come try. Everyone come sample. Does it taste the same? I don't think it tastes that different, like but I'm also smells. more acquired to like... I feel like it smells like the other one. Oh, yeah, I need a bigger yeah. cheese. What's the review? Tastes really good. Tastes normal? Tastes like bean dip. Yeah. yeah, I don't feel like it's tasting like that different to me. Yeah. All right, thumbs up. I'll put the recipe down below if you guys want it. I think I'll end the vlog here. We're gonna watch The Bachelor. Super exciting day. We announced our baby. So you guys both think it's a girl. Yeah. It's because. a girl. You think? Because we have a girl and they said that... <laughs> They think we had a girl too. Did that make sense when I just said Wait, who thought you had yeah. a girl? The doctors, like, everybody thought we were going to have a girl. It was true well, for us. We'll see. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next no, vlog. No, no, no. Bye! Bye.